New video in tonight that shows a tow truck driver in Dallas trying to pull away a woman's car, but the deal is she's still sitting inside. This happened in the midst of a confrontation, we're told, that had witnesses jumping in to intervene. Andrea Lucia live for us in our Dallas newsroom tonight. What else have you learned about this deal? Yeah, well, a witness started recording that video after tempers flare. The owner of the towing company says it does not tell the whole story. So we tracked down a second video. Watch the man in red step up and block the car's path while others yell at the woman inside to drive away. Moments later, you see the car being lifted with her still inside. I don't know this lady at all. She's in her car. Raymond Sasser says he shot this video to show what the tow company was getting away with. It's legalized carjacking because they can simply just take your car while you're in it. The Texas Department of Licensing and Regulation, which oversees towers, says it's not legal at all. If your car is not hitched up, if it's not ready for transport, they have to release it to the car owner. I mean, the car owner can drive away with it. Longhorn Towing's owner told me over the phone the car was hitched before the owner arrived. He says the video only captures it briefly released as the tower maneuvers around this white truck trying to block it in. So we checked another video, this one from a liquor store surveillance camera. Just as the tow truck backs up, it shows the driver pop into view at the top of the screen. And there's the man in red standing by the driver's side door blocking her so she can't get in. She wasn't there before the tow truck. But she was definitely there before it was hitched. She eventually does jump inside, but isn't allowed to leave. This is clearly wrong. This is clearly wrong. And if you would look at the tow Yeah, the tow truck did eventually leave with, with the woman's car. The tow company, though, says she got that car back later today by paying a discounted fee. We have not been able to reach that driver, but we are interested in hearing from her. Doug? Hey, before we let you go, I'm curious to answer a question. I think all of us may be curious about it at some point or another. If you walk out somewhere and you see your car is getting towed or about to get towed, what are the rules? What, what, where are your rights with all that? Well, there's three different scenarios here. If you walk out and your car is not hitched and ready to roll, then you get your car back at no charge. If it's hooked up and about to leave, you can still get it back, but you have to pay a drop fee. If your car, though, is on the road, you're going to have to find out where the vehicle storage yard is, head over there, and pay the full tow fee. Honestly, I've always been curious yeah, about where, you know, what, is your, what is your right. All right, Andrea, thanks for the explanation. Appreciate it.